Fantasy check-in for the New York Knicks, one of the most confusing teams in the NBA. We know that Luke Cornett has been installed as the starter at center over Ennis Cantor. Uh, Cornett is worth a grab in majority of leagues. I have no idea what David Fisdale is going to do because, let's be honest, David Fisdale has no idea what David Fisdale is going to do, let alone his players who he refuses to talk to about any decisions regarding rotations and changes because that's exactly what a great coach does. Um, Cornet is worth an ad. He hits threes, he blocks shots, he's rebounding well. He's actually, his passing has been pretty strong as well. As for Ennis Cantor, I'm really concerned about him. And in fact, even before the benching, the, the production wasn't great. He's the 173rd ranked player over the last two weeks in 22 minutes a night, and he's not getting 22 minutes a night as well. And that's going to be further complicated by the return of Mitchell Robinson. I think that uh, Cantor is going to be bought out, traded, or sat out of the rotation entirely. And I think if there's a hot free agent around, I think that Cantor has to be considered a drop candidate in your shallow leagues, 10s, and probably 12-team formats. The fort, Kevin Knox, is scoring well. It looks great, 18 points. Two threes also looks positive. And then he just does nothing in the other areas. Six re Under six rebounds, one assist, half a steal, 0.2 blocks, 40 and 75% from the field. He's better suited to points leagues. He's fine to have in category 12 team leagues, but he is not a hot property type of a player. A guy who is a hot property guy at the moment, Noah Vonley, averaging 12 and 11 with 1.6 blocks. His minutes, his production fluctuates quite a bit. He's very strong in rebounds. The blocks are at a career high rate, but you can rely upon him for rebounds. And the free throws are also at career high type numbers. So while I don't think he's necessarily a must-add player, a bloke that's the top 50 guy over the last two weeks who's available in 44% of leagues, you've got to consider, and you have to have a look to see how that fits. Well, Emmanuel Moutier, who's getting the minutes, but it's back to old Moutier, 212th over the last two weeks because of poor percentages not doing much in steals or blocks or only two rebounds per game. I still think he is a 12-team league guy, and I'd have him say over a DJ Augustine who's playing quite well in Orlando at the moment. But yeah, is he a, a must roster, absolutely have to hold on to under all circumstances sort of a guy? No, he's not. And the rest of this team, guys who have flirted with value before, Alonzo Trier, Damo Dotson. Yeah, I don't think there's much to see with those guys, this rotation. Uh, at least on the wings with Hardaway and Knox playing there, it's going to be hard for those guys to crack in and play minutes.